Jemima Marcus, a 17-year-old student of Angus Memorial Secondary School in Shomolu, Lagos East, on Monday acted for a brief moment as one-day governor of Lagos State. This follows her emergence as winner of the 2020 edition of the Spelling Bee competition. Plus TV Africa's State House correspondent, Love Ikuku Oyedokun, tells us more. Jemima, an indigenous of Edo State, won the 2020 edition of the Spelling Bee competition. As such, she earned the honor to become the one day governor of Lagos State. The weekly executive council meeting of the state's cabinet was recited over by her. Governor Sawunlu observed the proceedings. I now hereby look for an adjournment. The one day governor described Sawunlu as a transformational leader. She said the governor had recorded giant strides in education, health, housing, infrastructure renewal, transportation youth and women development in the last two years of the administration. She harped on the need to commit more investment to digital literacy across public schools in the state. She urged Samuel to ensure that the metropolitan fiber being laid across Lagos drops in public schools as promised. Mr. Gondor, sir. We are in the 21st century, which is also the digital age, and Lagos State definitely wants to produce next Elon Musk, Mark Zuckerberg, or even Steve Jobs. And this can only be possible if public schools across the state are well equipped with digital devices to improve learning and research. The One Day Governorship Program, according to Governor Sawunlu, is one of the ways employed by the state to raise future leaders. The governor took note of Jemima's request for more investment in education. Your requests and your points are well noted. Um, how we need to improve transportation within our schools, especially your own school. We have to look at it. And we've commented us on all of our initiatives at school, construction, school rehabilitation. I'm sure you know that we've done thousands and thousands of those new things. This spelling bee competition is a context between public schools across Lagos. It's one of the legacy programs in the state's education sector. It was pioneered in 2021 by Senator Olure Mutinubu through her New Era Foundation. From Lagos, Lab Ikuku Uyedoku for Plus TV Africa. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.